everyone, my name's Bettina, and after months of anticipation, we finally have the next part of The Soul of Joy, which is a fan game of Undertale, just with my character Joyce inserted into it. I am really excited to play this, since it's been so long since I played the first chapter of The Soul of Joy. Elric Murphy, I will remember to get your name correct in the description and right here. Uh, they put in so much work into it. There have been a few changes that I'm kind of aware of, and I will show you those changes to the first portion with the ruins, and then we have the Snowden part. I don't know how this series is going to be broken up, but probably highlights of the ruins changes, and then the Snowden portion, which I am really excited to play. And yep, here's a new gameplay series for you. I know I've been really slow on uploading new comic dubs, but I promise to get into that as well. But for now, let's play a game. Alright, so as you can see, it starts out like this. We've got the Soul of Joy. This is 0.2.0 by Eric Murphy. You should update it to say 2019 now, since it is now updated. I am playing this on January 16th, 2019. I don't know when this is going to be uploaded, but as soon as I do, you will have a download link on Game Jolt, because this game will be available. Let's start the game. Okay, takes a while. I named it uh, Soul of Joy Snowden. Notice, the Soul of Joy is based on an Undertale AU called Pinktail. As such, this game contains spoilers to Undertale's plot, including both the pacifist and genocide routes. It is highly recommended that you only play this game if you are familiar with all three routes in Underta Undertale, and to also support Undertale itself. Press Z or N to proceed to the game. If you don't know what Undertale is, you're on the wrong channel and watching the wrong series, so go check out Undertale, it's only $10. And also check out Deltarune, which is free. This game is also free, by the way, so make sure to play it yourself, or you can just watch me play it. So let us go. Oh, look at that. You've got me and Neela together. That's a character created by Fast Rain Badass. And we've got up six opportunities for saves. Interesting. And unfortunately, this is the size of the game. So let's zoom that in so you can get a real good look at it. And, all right, let us make a new save. So we're starting from the very beginning. I'll um, probably go through this really fast and only highlight the dialogue changes or any other major level changes, but let's go through the story. You can watch my original playthrough series if you haven't already. So, okay. Ooh, interesting. Okay, so I guess I can't go back here. So that's interesting. I wonder if I, that happened before. It's really nice. All the vines. Ah, I should have known. This kid is about as naive as the other child who fell down. Now that I think about it, her soul trait does seem unusual too. Then there's also those weird changes in the ruins. Hey, Flowey, is everything okay? Oh, yes, yes. I was just lost in my thoughts for a moment. You should hurry and touch that save point. Hmm, okay. Oh, I skipped that. Now there. Now then, there's something you should practice before moving forward. Talk to me when you are ready. Well, ooh, that's cool. Okay. Alright, let's get started. First, a lesson about souls. A soul is a culmination of one being. Every human and monster has one. As for humans, their souls are known for having a trait that reflects on how they grow and perform. That's nice. Tell me, Joyce, have you partaken in a fight before? A fight? No, I haven't. Well, this will be a grand moment for us to figure out what your soul is really made of. Flowey, what are you about to do? Don't worry, I'll go easy on you for this round. Really? Joy? What kind of useless magic is that? Magic? Well, I guess that's one thing you could call it. Of course it was magic, and a useless one at that. You know what? Forget it. This isn't fun anymore. Alright. I don't remember all these vines hanging about. Maybe that's new. Ow. I feel like 
there's more vines hanging about. So that's interesting. Ooh, it's a frog -it. from a frog it No, I thought I did it. God damn it. Yes. Okay, now I got it. Yay, it worked. Interesting. I thought for sure you were a goner there. Well, I was twice. What, do you need me to tell you what to do? Try grabbing onto one of those small ledges in the back there, then jump from one to the other. You can jump from the other direction by holding down the opposite directional key, and then using the jump action. I know what to do, I just like to click on everything. Lastly, you can also use the down direction to let go, and up to pull yourself onto the ledge. Granted, you have proper footing. Secret area with candy! This is new. There's no sign on it. Take a piece anyway. You took a piece of monster candy. Nice. So, here's... Uh, I pressed X, and that gives me my menu. I've got a monster candy. Monster candy. Candy you found in the ruins. You're not sure what flavor it is, but hopefully it isn't licorice. Nice. So... Armor. I have a hairpin. When entering a fight, Joyful Ore will automatically cast. Tools. No tools discovered. Quest. I don't have a quest. Nice. Alright. Interesting. So, here we go. See, that wasn't so bad, now was it? I like that little secret room ladder. Another ladder. know how to swim, kiddo. These pools are pretty deep. Here's another new section of the ruins. Well, I can stay afloat for a little bit. Oh, and how long would that be? A few seconds? Well, hopefully that's long enough. Well, jump on in. Okay. Whoops. Okay. Funny how she climbs ladders like. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you can see my little water bar. Nice. So that's not too hard. Okay, filled with joy. Oh, that's funny. The spiders don't do anything to me, so they're just there for. I don't know. I remember the first playthrough, this tripped me up so much. It was so annoying. No fall damage! Hmm. Huh. I see, that's... what? That was a bug. That looked weird. Okay. Yeah, the spiders don't do anything to me. It's a little weird. So they're false enemies. If I fall into the water, I can look at- I can climb- oh no! Okay. Okay. It must be because of my streaming. Okay. Oh, I can't- 
I can't do the up. Fight you. Ow. I better take fast. I only have one more joy point. No, not small. Okay, might have to do this off screen. Hold on a second. Okay, I beat the mold small without too much trouble, and it's a pink thing. Squirk squish. Hey, you should know. Your powers won't work in every situation. Some monsters may have a particular trouble that should be resolved for your powers to become effective. This could involve a certain action, or presenting them with a certain item. Okay. So that just took something away. There's next Bluke. Um, excuse me, but... Leave me alone already. Okay. Ow. I like the Naps Blue fight. Uh, goes on quite a while. I guess I have to say, ineffective. If I get hit again- oh, okay. <sighs> Napster Bloke's not falling ar fooling around. I think these, uh, Napster Bloke's, uh, battle tiers could be shortened a little bit. I can't flee, so why is it even there? Ooh, maybe I can have some monster candy. Lime flavor. There's a strong bite to it. You recovered 5 HP. <laughs> I had lime flavored monster candy. I wonder if they're all different flavors. That would be cool if they are. Too bad I can't go and get more monster candy. Oh no! It's a black hole! Instead of water because we established that water isn't too bad. Oh no! I guess it's ink. Kid, hang on, I've got ya! Flowey, are you okay? Forget it, it's not important, it's just... I was expecting a child with a determination soul to so show up right around this time. Listen, there's something I feel I should explain to you. You said you have special powers that can make others feel joyful, right? Uh-huh. Listen, kid, whatever it is you're doing, you're clearly tapping into your soul in order to cast these powers. That's what we monsters call magic. So does that mean my soul's trait is joy? Yeah, sure, we'll put it as that. The one thing is, the humans supposedly lost their ability to use magic a long time ago. But you and that other child are different. You're able to use magic. That's why you've caught my interest. Other child? You mean there's another human around here? Look, can we please just hurry up and get going? So sorry. Okay, so there's more foreshadowing. Finally, now start by going down that corridor. I'll catch up with you. Alright. Okay, I like that. So, we know more about Neela. I mean, you guys should know about Neela if you've played my first playthrough, but it, this is earlier in the game. Okay, and this is across water. I'm just gonna save there in case I call it. Well, this is it. We're almost at the end of the ruins. I wish you the best of luck, Joyce. You're gonna need it. Okay, so here I'm in water, and if I fall in, I can climb out. Oh, oops. Oh, and I see little platforms over there. Okay. And there are spiders. I don't think... Okay, that spider hurts me. Whoops. Okay, get out. Jump on all 
all the platforms correctly. And avoid the spiders. No! I didn't do it. Okay. We should mess it up, Joyce. Yeah, this is a challenge. No! Okay. Well, at least I don't have to die. Maybe I'll do this off screen. Okay, across the water. Okay, I thought I saw something up there. No, that's just the walls. Okay, encountering another monster. And a toy, eat your green. Orange flavor tastes pretty sweet, even though it tries to be sour. You just recovered eight. Do I still have my monster candy? Okay. I missed it! You should have more greens in this fight! Still have the monster candy. Great flavor. It's not strawberry, but it's your second favorite. Your HP was maxed out. I like grapes. Okay. Got the green. No! I was so close! Dang it. Okay. I get to check out all the monster flavor candy- monster candy flavors this way, though. Alright, I got the Vegetoid. Vegetoid is here for your health. Okay, that's all you say. The red is good. Hmm. 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 Interesting. Trial and error. Luke's in the last time, but I need the eye drops. Yeah, I'm gonna save with the eye drops in my position. Yeah, eye drops! Gave Luke the eye drops. Luke's been cured.
like the randomization. Okay. Yes, all the way. The world is full of secrets, secrets that you may not miss at first glance. Always look twice and don't hesitate to backtrack. Okay, you never know what you might discover. I would only backtrack if you let me. Because I don't think this game lets you backtrack necessarily. But maybe if I look. Oops. No, there's nothing there. Okay. I think I heard something outside. Please wait here, my child. Aw, Toria looks nice. Oh, hello there. I wasn't expecting another human to come this way. Are you lost, my child? Did you get hurt? Well, yes. I don't really know where I'm going, and I ran into a few traps along the way, too. You poor thing. My name is Toria, Garden, guardian of the ruins. It's interesting you give her a blue color, so she's like the color of patience. I am Joyce. Joyce, that is a nice name. Here, allow me to help with the introductions. Joyce, this is Neela. Hello. Hi. Sorry, she's a little shy. So sorry. Knock, knock. Who's there? Pink. Pink who? Well, I'm thinking of a better joke. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that one was pretty awful. Long walk. Almost longer than Frisk's walk. You want to leave that badly? Mom, please, listen. I know it's dangerous, and I know I might get hurt. I'm really grateful for everything you have done for me, but please, please let us go. I promise, Neil and I will be careful. Mom, please, I want to go too. I want to see the world, with Joyce. You are just like the others. There is only one solution to this. Prove yourself. Prove to me that you are strong enough to survive. Okay. Mom?
stop. Uh, Mila. Mom. No, I understand, Joyce. The ruins are small once you get used to them. Neither of you will be able to lead a happy life here. It wouldn't be right to keep you here. My worries, my fears. For you, I will set them aside. But once you leave, understand that you will not be able to come back. Goodbye. Please be good and be happy. Goodbye, Mom. Thank you for everything. Well, howdy there, kiddo. Long time no see. Oh. Oh, am I really that scary to you? Leave her alone. Oh, you sure got a lot of confidence for someone who lacks a fight option. Not to mention, it would seem your soul has just started to weaken. Oh, uh, what? Oh. Your SP has greatly decreased and your soul diminished. This can't be. Joyce, are you okay? She'll be fine, but it would appear she's lost her SP. SP? Soul power, a measure of how strong your soul has grown. You only gain it by nurturing your soul's trait. Nurturing your soul's trait? Then this means... We left Toriel saddened, so I've lost my HP. Oh. Well, don't you worry. There will be plenty of opportunities to get it back. You've all caught my interest, so I'm going to let you run free for a while. Just don't die on me too quickly, okay? Take care. Joyce. Don't worry, Mila. I don't think he's going to bother us for a while. Come on, let's go and start our adventure. All right. All right. Here is the new part. Ah, uh, it's Papyrus. I saw a gif of this, uh, like, kind of spoilery, but... Wow. <laughs> oh, no. Poor Papyrus. I guess we're not going to see that puzzle. That's cute. <gasps>